The ketogenic diet, or keto for short, is a popular low-carbohydrate, high-fat diet that has gained widespread popularity in recent years. However, concerns have been raised about the potential link between the keto diet and kidney stones. Kidney stones are a common condition that can cause severe pain and discomfort and can have serious health consequences if left untreated. The purpose of this comparison is to explore the connection between the keto diet and kidney stones and to provide an overview of strategies for reducing the risk of developing kidney stones on the keto diet. There is some evidence to suggest that the keto diet may increase the risk of developing kidney stones. One possible reason for this is that the keto diet can lead to an increase in urine calcium excretion, which can contribute to the formation of kidney stones. In addition, the high protein intake on the keto diet can lead to an increase in uric acid production, which can also increase the risk of kidney stone formation. However, it's important to note that not all studies have found a clear link between the keto diet and kidney stones, and more research is needed to fully understand the relationship between the two. Nonetheless, there are several strategies that individuals on the keto diet can use to reduce their risk of developing kidney stones, such as staying hydrated, monitoring their calcium intake, and incorporating plenty of low-carbohydrate vegetables into their meals. Kidney stones are small, hard deposits that form in the kidneys and can cause significant discomfort and pain. They are made up of various substances, including calcium, oxalate, and uric acid, and can range in size from a grain of sand to a golf ball. While anyone can develop kidney stones, there are several risk factors that can increase the likelihood of their formation, such as a family history of kidney stones, dehydration, and certain medical conditions. Symptoms of kidney stones can vary depending on the size and location of the stone, but commonly include pain in the back, sides, or lower abdomen, painful urination, blood in the urine, nausea, and frequent urination. Treatment options for kidney stones may include medications to manage pain and facilitate passage of the stones, or in more severe cases, surgery may be necessary to remove the stones. There is some evidence to suggest that the keto diet may increase the risk of developing kidney stones, although the connection is not entirely clear. One possible explanation is that the high levels of protein and fat in the diet can lead to an increase in uric acid and calcium in the urine, which can contribute to the formation of kidney stones. However, other research suggests that the keto diet may actually decrease the risk of kidney stones by reducing the levels of oxalate in the urine. Overall, more research is needed to fully understand the potential link between the keto diet and kidney stones. In the meantime, it is important for individuals on the keto diet to stay hydrated and monitor their urine for signs of dehydration and kidney stone formation. There are several strategies that individuals on the keto diet can use to reduce the risk of developing kidney stones. One of the most important is staying hydrated by drinking plenty of water throughout the day. This can help to flush out excess minerals and other substances that can contribute to the formation of kidney stones. Additionally, it may be helpful to limit the intake of animal protein and increase the consumption of plant-based sources of protein. Some foods that are high in oxalates, such as spinach and almonds, may also need to be limited. On the other hand, foods that are high in citrate, such as lemons and limes, may be beneficial in preventing kidney stone formation. It is important to work with a healthcare professional or registered dietitian to develop a personalized keto diet plan that takes into account individual needs and risk factors. In conclusion, while there may be a potential connection between the keto diet and kidney stones, 
there is still much research to be done to fully understand the relationship. However, it is clear that proper nutrition and hydration are crucial for reducing the risk of kidney stone formation in general. Individuals on the keto diet should prioritize staying well hydrated and consuming a balanced, nutrient-dense diet that includes a variety of protein sources and limits foods that are high in oxalates. It is also important to work with a healthcare professional to monitor kidney health and adjust the diet as needed to minimize any potential risk. Ultimately, with proper care and attention, individuals can successfully follow the keto diet while minimizing the risk of developing kidney stones.